Hi guys, Velian Speaks Tech. Today is Friday, the weather outside is dark and rainy, you're feeling sad and lonely, and something is missing. And yes, yes. you're watching this video because something is missing, and that's Volti. You don't have Volti on your phone. So you want to get Volti on your phone, watch this video to understand how you can do this. Why Volti is so important. important. First, it makes all the voice connections go through LT or 4G and the call sound really better. When you call somebody with Volde, it's almost like instantaneously. The calls connect more quickly, you have a longer battery life and the most important thing, while you're having a call over Volte, you can still use your 4G data, all right? So this is Volte. If you want to find out how to enable it on your OnePlus 7 phone or the OnePlus 7 Pro, OnePlus 6 and 6T, stay tuned and watch the full video. And don't forget to subscribe. Let me show you why I need Volti. Hi kid, you having fun tonight? What is the secret recipe? Volti. What? Volti. Respect. In order to install Volte on your phone, you need these four simple things. First step, install the Unlock Kit APK on your phone. What this will do, it will allow you to enable the Volte switch on and off in your phone if you're missing it. Second step, download the Android Engineering Mode APK on your phone and install it. This will allow you to set up Volta. You're gonna see how and all the download links are below into the video description. Third step, install the QPST on your PC. And last but not least, the fourth step, install the driver on your PC as well. This is number four here. So let's install the first APK, the OM Lock Kit. It will allow us to enable the Volta switch on and off. Going into downloads, I number them guys, press it, install, OnePlus lock kit. Okay, up installed. To make sure that it is properly installed, go into the diner and press star-800- Complete action using engineering mode, just go for just once. And now you can see the system settings, very important now. With these options here, we can or we should enable the Volte switch. The lock kit APK will allow us to enable the Volte switch guys, but just check in some countries, specifically the ROMs that I use, probably will have it inside. Most of the phones that are shipped with the EU or the global ROM don't have this. So you can go here to Wi-Fi and internet, click on the SIM and network, click on the first SIM, the one that should be Volte enabled, and then you should check if you have the Volte switch, yes or no. In my case, I have it because I already installed it, but in your case, you will not have it. So in order to enable the Volte switch, just let's do the following. Open a dialer, press star dash 800 star, and then complete action using engineering menu. You're gonna get a lock test. Now click on OnePlus lock kit, guys. Scroll down, click on the function switch, and make sure that you enable voltage switch. So you put a checkbox here on voltage switch and on wall Wi-Fi switch as well. Your phone will ask you to reboot, reboot, and then we continue with the installation. Now we need to install the second APK from my tutorial. This is this one here that will enable the engineering mode. So just press install. The reason for doing this is that OnePlus decided to remove that in the latest versions of Oxygen. So that's why we're doing this. Up install, press done. Now in order to check if this is working, just go again into the dialer, but this time press star-801- and now we're gonna see complete engineering mode and now we entered the engineering mode. What you should do right now is just click on the full port switch, now it's off, click it on on and connect the phone to the PC. Welcome to the third step, so first unzip it somewhere. I'm using 7-zip guys. So QPST is the program that will allow you to change the profile or the configurations and you're gonna see how I'm using that to enable Vode. Very cautious with this program, follow this video and make no mistakes. Okay, I'm pressing the exe files, the installation files, Qualcomm setup. Now it's very important guys, if you are using some other Qualcomm drivers, maybe you have another phone like a Xiaomi, maybe it's a good idea to remove them before proceeding with installing this one. We are installing the QPST 2.7, finish, 
boom, there it is. Fourth step, let's install also the OnePlus driver. Okay. It will take a while, don't panic now and don't exit the process. Press next here guys, but make sure that you have selected the first option, WWAN or VVAN DHCP. Okay, next, next again, accept the terms, press next again and install. Jesus Christ, why it's so complex. Okay, the install shield wizard completed, press finish and you should be all set. Let's enable the Voltem magic. If everything works fine right now, you should be able to open the program called PDC, which is part of the QPST. So just type PDC, you're gonna see it there. This program is installed with the QPST and with some other tools, but for now, just use PDC. Double click on PDC. If the drive is properly installed here on the device section, you should be able to see your device. In my case, we can read here Qualcomm HBUSB WWN adapter 9191. And now this is the very important step guys. This is really how we're gonna enable Volta. What we can see right now here on the screen is that the OVC commercial DS profile is active. Some information on what we see on the screen, Sub-Zero, <laughs> Mortal Kombat, Sub-Zero means first SIM card. If you have another SIM card or it's like a second SIM card, Sub-1 is actually the second SIM card. So both of them now are active with the OVC commercial profile. And what we wanna do is disable this profile and enable a profile from the ones below that runs with Volti. Right click here on the OVC commercial DS, select deactivate and then sub zero, which is the first SIM card. What you can see right now is that the first SIM card sub zero is already inactive. So if you have a second SIM card, just right click again, deactivate sub one, which is actually the second SIM card, okay. What we need to do right now, guys, is just enable one of the below Volti profiles. Now I live in Europe, in Bulgaria, and I've tested most of them and I think 80% of them work for me. I'm using the Norway Talia commercial profile, but in your case, you can try with some of the others. So maybe you can use the UK Volti. This is one of the most common used profiles, or you can use also the one here, like Italy Volta Vodafone or Germany Volta Vodafone. If you're in India, India Volta Vodafone, I will leave this up to you guys to decide what is best for you. Right now, I'm using the Norway Talia commercial, which enables Volta for me. So I select this one, right click with the mouse, Set selected config sub zero to enable now the first SIM card. Right click it again, set selected config sub one. And now you're gonna see that both SIM cards, the sub zero and the sub one are here pending. And what we need to do is just press the activate button. Okay, wait, magic applied. And now you see that the Norway Taylor commercial sub zero and sub one profiles are activated. Very important disclaimer guys, don't delete the OVC commercial. There are some video tutorials which kind of encourage you to delete the OVC commercial profile. The reason for that is that on the OnePlus 6 and OnePlus 6 every time you reboot your phone, the OVC commercial profile will be set as active, or even if you eject the SIM tray. Now I can confirm that on the OnePlus 7 and on the OnePlus 7 Pro, this doesn't happen. But why I'm saying to not delete this profile, because it has been reported that if you delete the OVC commercial DS profile and you enter roaming mode, so let's say you go into another country, then connect to a not a native network, you might have problems you know, with your data. So don't delete this, it's not safe. Now our work is done and we just have some final steps to enable Volte on our phone. Now the sweetest step is just waiting for us and that's the last one, enabling the Volte. So we're gonna go into settings, Wi-Fi and internet, click SIM and network, click your Volte activated card, and now on the Volte switch, just press on, and look what happens here. Boom, Volte! So we did it, guys. So I hope that you will now enjoy your Volte calls. Just to be safe, when somebody is also running Volte and you're running Volte and you call this guy, you should see the HD sign here. But actually, let me tell you something, guys. You will not only see this sign, you will be able to hear it. The quality, the voice quality is absolutely better. It does connect almost instantaneously. And I can tell you, this is gonna be the point that will decide you'll never go back to something else. So if you manage to enable Volte, following my guide, again, all the download links you can find into the video description below. Have a happy Friday, please smash like the hit button. I'm putting a lot of efforts into making those videos and I know you appreciate it guys. Subscribe for my channel, like the video and come back for more content like this. Boom, Venia Speaks Tech over.